we have recently developed the technology to time travel. We have interviewed some of the smartest dead people from the 1600s. We had to blend in with the culture so the cameras were hidden and we could not reveal information about the Welcome to a blast from the past news station, also known as News News! who say they're part of the scientific reformation. They have said they are willing to talk to us about their beliefs. beliefs. Well, if you want me to do the camera... Geocentric model. A geocentric model has three three rules. The first rule is all motion in the heavens is uniform circular motion. This means that the planets cannot move any farther from the Earth or any closer. 
The second rule is all matter in the heavens is made up of perfect material. This means that its intrinsic properties can't change. Now the third rule the third rule is that all the planets revolve around the Earth. Nothing else. That's what makes our model geocentric. Pretty interesting model, and I do agree, do agree with most of it, except for the fact that all the planets stay the same distance away. You see, the planets are constantly getting brighter and darker, so something has got to be going on with them. So. Hear me out. So this is the so this is the Earth, and and here's and here's the line of where the planets go. They're going in one big circle. But what if they're not? But what if they on that big circle, they're going in tiny circles on that circle. That is what I would call epicycles. But what if they go and it's probably not even that. We probably should go deeper. Not just a circle on top of a circle, but a circle on top of a circle on top of a circle. Or even more than that. Because they're constantly getting brighter and darker as we, as we speak. So what you're saying is Epicycles cause us to see different shades of light, dark or brighter. That causes that? Yep, that's what I'm saying. That makes sense. I think we got ourselves yes. a project. If we so if we put these two models together, we'll have the perfect model of our universe. I discovered that the Earth is the center of the universe and that everything is perfect. All the stars are in exactly the right places and everything is exactly the right distance. I discovered the same, except that planets have epicycles and refinements. I discovered the sun was the center of the universe. I discovered that the planets orbit elliptically, not circularly. Wow. I discovered the planets are not perfect and the, the stars are not fixed. I think the geocentric model is correct, not heliocentric. I would accept your theory if you had more proof, but... I'm going to stick with my own for now. <clears throat> that is all we have for today. Thank you for watching. A Blast from the Past.